Two major problems in today's fueling operation are splashback and clicking off or early shutoff. Splashback can be caused by several factors. One of the more common causes is fill pipe configuration. Today, gas tanks and the fill pipes leading to these tanks have been designed into vehicles based on crash or impact considerations, or into a convenient location after other design considerations have been made. In addition, environmental considerations have dramatically altered the shape of fill pipes, so vapors can be collected inside the vehicle. Onboard Retention Vapor Recovery, ORVR, is one of the most dramatic changes in the fueling process. Historically, automobile fill pipes were 1.5 inches to 2 inches in diameter. The larger fill neck would accommodate a broad stream of fuel. Unfortunately, these large fill pipes also allowed increased vapor emissions. Today, stringent pollutant controls have reduced vapor emissions, but have also increased splashback at the fill pipe. Today's safety, design, and environmental factors have resulted in one, narrow fill pipes less than one inch in diameter, and two, have made the fill pipe configuration a labyrinth for incoming fuel. The overall result is more occasions of splashback than ever before. More splashback means more customer complaints and more vapor emissions. Splashback is primarily a nuisance problem. However, it can also be a safety and environmental hazard. Early shutoff, on the other hand, is an occasion of lost revenue. Early shutoff occurs when a nozzle's automatic shutoff feature incorrectly indicates that the vehicle's tank is full, when in fact it is less than full. The result is lost revenue for the station operator. Both of these problems, splashback and early shutoff, have the same root cause, turbulence of the fuel flow in the fill pipe. That's why Husky developed the Stream Shaper. The Husky Stream Shaper does just what its name implies. It shapes the fuel stream into a narrow, compact flow that matches the narrow, compact, and often contorted configuration of today's ORVR fill pipes. The shaped stream of fuel, combined with the velocity of the liquid, reduces the turbulence in the neck of the fill pipe. This reduced turbulence means a cleaner, smoother flow, and that means less splashback and fewer early shutoffs. Here's a view of a typical nozzle without the Stream Shaper. Once released from the nozzle, fuel has a shotgun pattern. A fuel flow with this unmanaged pattern at 10 gallons per minute stands a good chance of quickly causing splashback or shutting off the nozzle prematurely. The result is a dangerous situation and an irritated customer. The Stream Shaper is designed to prevent this situation. Here is the Husky Stream Shaper in action. The fuel flow is compact and direct. It is controlled. The fluted design is like taking your finger off the end of a garden hose. The flow is literally shaped to fit and flow easily through the ORVR fill pipe, no matter what its configuration. The secret of the Husky Stream Shaper is a simple but effective device we've incorporated into the tip of the nozzle. This patented device utilizes one of the principles for laminar flow, a principle found in both pneumatic and hydraulic flow conditions. It shapes the fuel's escape from the nozzle. By controlling the fuel flow into a compact shaped stream rather than allowing it to scatter, Husky has greatly reduced the occurrence of splashback and premature shutoff. The Stream Shaper is another example of Husky combining innovation and nozzle technology. We call it in nozzlevation. How will your customers know when you've gone to a Husky Stream Shaper nozzle? When you go from this to this. Husky Stream Shaper, shouldn't your customers have it?